LSUA is home to about 60 international students, 10 of which are still on campus. Of course, with the current pandemic, they are still on campus for one of two reasons. Either they feel safer here, or they cannot travel to their prospective homes. They may have some travel restrictions trying to get home, but um, for whatever the reason is, we're just happy that, that they can be here and they feel safe and comfortable. Safe and comfortable. Those are key words needed in times of uncertainty. For international students such as Andres, he says the decision to go home was out of his hands. Pretty much I didn't have a choice but to stay. Uh, reason being not only that currently my country's borders are closed, but also I am going to graduate at the end of the semester. So I'm going to be looking to maybe work here. Andres' immediate family is still at home safe in Dominica but he does have a sister further south in New Orleans. As for the relationship between the students and faculty, it's grown more over the weeks due to more communication. We have tried to be as creative and as innovative as possible with our support, with our communication. We do more texting, more Zoom sessions, um, a lot more emails as well. Very often we get emails from the Chancellor, from the Vice Chancellor, find out how we're doing, especially us staying on campus. They find out how we're doing, what we need, anything like that. As an, international, as an international student, there is also an international student association. And they keep in contact with us as well as international students to make sure that we have everything that we need. Within reach, without limits, is how the LSUA family is navigating through current situations. And although this is a learning experience from both sides, everyone is being strong for each other. This has really brought us closer because there is no, there's no template. There's no rule book, there's no theory on how to go through something like this, but we've, we've come together, we've brainstormed, and we've always put students first. We can say that, that we, we are a little bit closer because, I mean, the focus is, is kind of on us now, like especially being international and staying here, staying abroad away from the family. So, I mean, together we, we have to be strong for each other as an international, as an international group, as an international family. Megan Glover, ABC 31 News.